with Dylan Scott. Good evening, everyone. It wasn't too long ago that they were packing the house at Clune Arena. And with Joe Scott coming back to town, his former players expect a return to greatness in the not too distant future. He's going to make them believers. He's going to make them doers. In his four years at the helm of the Air Force men's basketball program. You become fearless. You become so tough that, you know, you look at your opponent and it's they're almost not what everyone else thinks that they are. Joe Scott brought the Falcons to heights most never dreamt of. The toughness and all the, you know, resiliency that was in our DNA. So if Joe would have stayed, I mean, sky's the limit of how great we would have been. A true student of the game. He found untapped potential and let it loose. I know he'll go and find every gym rat in the country that, that knows how to win and try to put those guys together and, and try to make it mean something. A skill that will serve him well 15 years later. I just think the tone will be there. He won't have 40 cough drops a day, maybe two a day now. Uh, so his voice will be saved a little bit. Former players Antoine Hood, Jacob Birchie, and Nick Welsh were all part of that historic 2003-4 team. I think a lot of us took on his persona as an identity because, I mean, Joe was an underdog as well. And, you know, his philosophy was, hey, we were going to hate him and bond together or love him and bond together. But either way, we were going to bond together. And believe their old ball coach has what it takes to change a culture that has seen seven straight losing seasons. Almost kind of like uh, like a Michael Jordan, you know, mirror type thing where he built it really well the first time, then he went away for a while, then came back and built it again, and you know, actually finished it out the way that it was supposed to be finished. A blast from the past, ready to make believers on the basketball court. There's no reason why Air Force can't be middle of the pack, upper pack, and then take a stab at the conference title every three, four years. And Joe Scott will be the guy that creates that. I think our will never lack identity again moving forward with Joe. And a big thank you to Antoine, Nick, and Jacob for their time. Three impressive examples of what it takes to build a winning program. Always watching out for you, Dylan Scott, News 5 Sports.